So this problem uh, is a problem that involves uh, compound interest. So how do you know it's a problem that involves compound interest? That's because here it says the interest is compounded uh, annually. So that means you're not going to use any formula when simple interest uh, is involved. So the formula you will be dealing with uh, is uh, the future value A equal to the principal P time 1 plus the, the interest rate R uh, over N raised to the N time uh, T. So the only new component here is the N. Okay, so the N uh, is uh, the number of times, okay, okay, the number of times the interest is calculated uh, per year. Okay, so how do we know how much N is? Take a look at here. Okay, so if it says the interest is compounded annually, so that means uh, N equal to 1. Okay, so the interest is only calculated once a year. Okay, so once you know all this, to find uh, the future value, so basically the amount of money in the account after three years, okay, uh, is going to be calculated as uh, A equal to, okay, so uh, $7,000 is... Um, deposited, so put 7,000 for the P, then times 1 plus, so the interest rate is given as 8%, so that will be 0 0.08, then divide N, N we already figured it should be 1, since the interest is compounded annually, and raised to the N times T, so N is 1, and T, T is 3 years, okay, 3 years, put the 3 here. So put everything into your calculator, okay? That will give you 8,000, so let's use the dollar sign, 8,000, okay? $817.984. So this is what the calculator gives you. But remember, this is a dollar amount, right? Um, so here they wanted to run to the nearest hundreds, okay? So run it to the nearest hundreds, so this is the hundreds place, and that is the cent, right? So $8,817.98, okay? So we run that to 817.98. So now basically we run it to the nearest cent. So that's the first part, okay? That's the first part. Then the second part, the amount of interest earned in these three years. So as you can see, uh, the amount of money deposited is 7,000. But after three years, you know, in the account, there are $8,817.98 sitting there, right? So as you can see, the 7,000 grew. So how much it grew? So that will be the interest. So to calculate the interest here, okay, Take the future value, okay, which is $8,817.98, then subtract uh, the principal, okay, and the answer is $1,817.98. So that is uh, the amount of interest earned uh, in these three years.